Now I'm going to say a few points about ELM. ELM means Active Learning Method. It is one of the most modern methodology followed in higher classes. But in our school, we adapt this method also. I'm going to give some important points about this method. It changes from teacher-centric to learner-centric passive reception to active interaction of the children, linear exposure to divergent exposure. Here the discipline stands alone, but in ALM, discipline has integrated form, divided curricular and extracurricular activities. ALM gives room for creative inputs. Evaluation stands normative. But in ALM, evaluation is formative and summative. Here the knowledge is given, but in ALM, knowledge is constructed. Rigid framework to flexible framework. As a whole, ALM facilitates teaching learning. Let us see the steps to be followed in ALM. In ALM, mind map plays a vital role. Regarding the mind map, the students will hit the important points in the lesson as a circular figure for the easy understanding. Next, they form a group among themselves. They go through the lesson. Hard words in the lesson will be referred in the dictionary. Peer group children help the children learn better. They discuss the lesson among themselves. Then they comprehend the lesson and finally they, each group of the students will explain their own part. Finally, question answer session will be held providing more opportunity for learning. At the end, the teacher will consolidate all the points in the lesson and she will clarify the doubts of the students. Definitely ALM is the better way for the children to learn more than through old method. Tamil Nadu government recommend this method to be followed from 6th standard onwards. But in our school, we follow this method for 4th and 5th standard. Let us see how our children are perform this method visually. Yes, that 
dictionary, go through the lesson first.